We are now just weeks away from cruise ships sailing out of U.S. ports for the first time in more than a year. Governor Ron DeSantis sued the CDC to get cruises sailing again, and there was a hearing about that in court today. Eight on your side, political reporter Evan Donovan is outside the federal courthouse in Tampa. He has the update on this ongoing court case. Last minute move, Keith. We actually had to come to the port here where these ships would pull in and out. The CDC issued a conditional sale order in October. It effectively shut down the cruise industry, and attorneys for the state of Florida have been arguing the CDC doesn't have that authority. But a law passed by Congress last month that has to do with the state of Alaska's cruising industry is the reason why Tampa, why federal Florida attorneys were in a Tampa federal courtroom today. Last month, Congress passed the Alaska Tourism Restoration Act, or ATRA. It allowed some cruises to sail to Alaska, but skip a stop in Canada that was required by law. The law referenced a conditional certificate issued by the CDC that allows cruise lines to get approval to sail. Thursday in federal court, the DOJ argued that by passing that law, Congress effectively gave the CDC the authority that Florida is arguing it doesn't have. Last week in Key Biscayne, Governor Ron DeSantis railed against the CDC for dragging its heels. The problem on this the whole time has been the CDC. They've mothballed this industry for over a year. And then, you know, we were in mediation with them. They were very unreasonable about some of the things that they were asking about. First part of the And mediation is still ongoing in this case. In fact, attorneys were scheduled to meet with a mediator just this afternoon after that court hearing was over. There could be a decision coming in this case as early as next week. Live in Tampa, Evan Donovan, 8 on your side.